Hey guys, today I'm going to be making a video on the sketchbook project. So far I've done two other videos on this topic. On the first one I kind of introduced it and I did a little bit of drawing on the cover of my sketchbook and on the second one I w talked about how I had kind of neglected it for a long time and I just did the very first page there. But it's been a long time and I've made a lot of progress. I'm almost done the sketchbook project, okay? I'm almost done. And so I know I probably should have made one more video in the middle there because it's kind of a sudden jump. But I've got a few pages left to fill. I've done a lot of cool spreads. Some of them I'm pretty happy with. Some of them not so much. But I'm going to do another spread today to fill in one of my last few pages. And let's get going. So I'm here in one of my favorite thinking spots. The bugs in the forest are crazy loud right now. There's just a hum everywhere. But that's beside the point because I have an idea for what I want to do on this page. I'm thinking I'm going to do a theme of exploration because that's something I haven't really touched on yet in my sketchbook. In all of my pages, I've kind of been doing a progression through history kind of thing. So some things I think I want on this page is pr probably a sailing ship, some space stuff, maybe some even more primitive type exploration related things, and hopefully a map or a compass of some kind. That's a good start, so let's see if we can get some ideas down onto paper. So I'm out here in the garage. It's pretty hot out here, but you gotta do what you gotta do, and I'm gonna get drawn. Okay, so I've got, a, I've got my blank page here, and now it's time to just block out where I want everything to go. So I think I want to put this a bow of this sh ship thing I was talking about just coming in from this side. I thought it would look really cool if I had like a transparent water, so like maybe put something under here and then tint it blue slightly later. Get that across there. So I've got the ship piece sketched in, and I think I'm going to ink it because I want to go with more of an approach of completing each section one at a time and then moving on to the next and layering them over top instead of planning out the whole thing in advance. It makes it feel a little bit more sketchbooky, and I like the fact that it gives it a multi, more multimedia feel than some of the other pages that I've done where I had planned them out in my previous sketchbook. Okay, so I really wanted to put the space segment up here, but it's kind of, the ship has been kind of encroaching up there. Maybe I'll put like a constellation type thing up here and then have a main space event right over on this corner. I'm not sure yet, but I just want to get into the inking, so we'll see what happens and I'll make something work. The inking is done. I'm going to run inside now and grab some watercolors so I can color in some of the plants and the water and maybe even some of the planks of the ship and that'll hopefully make it pop a little bit more off the page and set it deeper in the world in which I'm trying to create here.
going for a nice cartoony colorful look. And what I'm going to do next is put some black um, craft paint up along here. And I'm going to put a constellation up here to kind of represent like navigation. And over here I'm going to put a satellite of some kind or spacecraft. And then I think I'm going to put down in this corner some kind of navigation tool like a compass or maybe a sextant or something like that. And that is my plan so far. I think I'm going to get this paint painted in and be done for the night because... It's been a couple of days, I've had a bunch of things up, but I'm back to working on this, and we'll see how it goes, hopefully finishing this drawing in the next day or two. So this black paint's looking really good, but I think I'm going to start by doing the pencil sketch of some kind of sextant or compass right in here, because I don't really feel like painting onto that yet, that's a bit more, more of a commitment. So I got this page all finished up. I'm pretty happy with how it turned out. It's not quite how I was envisioning it, but that's how creativity works. It's never gonna go exactly as you think it is at the beginning. But overall, really happy with how it turned out. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one.